Pesach has been quite a feat. I mean, so many people have missed their Pesach programs. Oh, the horror. They actually had to clean their house. And there was no cleaning help. I mean, I really feel for you. How, how are you managing? It must be awful. Are your kids complaining at all? Are your kids upset with the kids program at your Passover program in the house? Are they complaining about the lack of choices in food? Well, my friends, on behalf of Pesach program organizers all over the world, now you know how it feels. <laughs> Woo! I think, I think the only thing the kids aren't complaining about is how much they paid. Hey, the Passover programs, the 24-hour tea rooms, the stations, the performers. Let's talk about the performers for a second. Have you noticed that the performers that usually do the programs are mamish going mishuga? They're doing Facebook live broadcasts. I mean, the comedians, the singers, the magicians, they're complaining how they were supposed to be in Prague and they were supposed to be in California and they were supposed to be in Italy and then some cruise in the Mediterranean. And Nebuch, now they're on Instagram with their kids nagging at them, complaining about the lack of options in the kitchen tea room. <laughs> So you got all, so I, I, I've been getting all these messages of this performance and that performance, even here, the From Prague performance. And my kids were really excited about some famous illusionist. And so we go on to the Zoom thing and I had to like type in the, the, the Zoom code U.US-964, you know, with the sign for Boron. And then you see thousands of people watching. And then he has his kid covering the screen during the illusion. I mean, he could have cut someone in half for the same price. Just have someone just cover the screen. Look at that, everyone. We cut him in half, yay! <laughs> Shweki had his kid holding the camera and, and he's shaking the camera the whole time during the performance. I still have a headache from it. Like I'm like... <laughs> Elon Gold kept complaining about his kid producing the live show. And then all these people were commenting so he couldn't get his hosts on. My friends, now you know how it feels. Now, then there's the back of the trucks. Let's talk about the back of the trucks. What is it with these trucks, with the music and people uh, uh, not doing social distancing on the back of the trucks? I mean, they're driving through the streets, they're driving through Crown Heights, through Flatbush. I don't think they were quite mitzvah tanks, but they were screaming happy Passover while riding through one of the most religious neighborhoods in the world, Crown Heights. I mean, honey, tell me, who were you screaming happy Passover to? Were you throwing shmura matzah off the back of the truck? I mean, no, 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 turn down lefferts. Maybe there there's some people that don't have any matzah. <laughs> Crown Heights performers, I have something serious to talk about. You know that you're supposed to stay at home. I mean, how are we going to stop this thing if you're running around like it's a regular Pesach? It's not a regular Pesach. Us poor people had been getting tons of free concerts, and we're loving every minute of it. <laughs> Woo! Uh -huh. and, and, and what's with Hask? They get the memo, we're all poor this year. Everything <laughs> is supposed to be free. I mean, did anyone actually watch it? I'm sure <laughs> that there was this one guy who paid for the concert, and then he sent the link only to his sister, who only sent the link to her best friend, who <laughs> only sent the link to her cousin. Basically, you get the idea. They probably made 18 bucks, but it's <laughs> for the children. <laughs> it was for the children, of course. So how else are you entertaining your kids? A friend of uh, mine put up a post that he's looking for camping equipment to borrow because they were going camping as a Cholomite trip in uh, their living room. <laughs> it's true. That's what he was doing. 
Anyway, I, I really feel bad for all the lonely people. There'll be no more lonely people, never again. So, I mean, asking yourself the four questions, sure. disagreeing with yourself all night. I mean, singing off tune with yourself. <laughs> I, I kept on seeing all these single people posting their like single satyrs, you know, like you have one plate and one thing and one that. And I was like really feeling bad about this whole thing. All these single people with their one thing. Then I see one guy, he has another satyr plate on the other side of a table. And, I, and I, I had to message him. I said, dude, like, why is there another satyr plate there? He's like, I have to have a satyr I never go to. So someone told me today, there's always next year. And yes, I think people who run Pesach programs, now is a good time to start advertising while this special experience is fresh in our minds. I'm hoping uh, to open this Mishpacha magazine and see, see in it, as per usual, an insane amount of Pesach programs. I'm thinking Italy, California, the Poconos, Aruba, a piece of bread. And, and when you see those ads, each one is trying to be much better than the next. I mean, I'm convinced that Benny Friedman has Kivitza Saderich. He's at every single Pesach program in the same night. I mean, there's only, eight nights of, there's only eight nights of Pesach. How can you go to 40 programs in 15 countries? And then there's people who will do anything to get you to come to their program. You want Yassela Rosenblatt? No problem. Shlomo Karabach, Lubavitcher Rebbe? Don't worry, we'll make it happen. Our Pesach program offers Gebrachs and non Gebrachs. Oh, yeah? Well, our Pesach program offers Gebrachs, non Gebrachs, Kidneyus, and non Kidneyus. Oh, yeah? Well, ours offers Gebrachs, non Gebrachs, a Kidneyus, a non Kidneyus, a Chol of Yisrael, and a Chol of Stam. Oh, yeah? Oh, yeah? Well, ours offers Gebrachs, non Gebrachs, a Kidneyus. And a non kidneyous, Chol Bistro, Chol Stam, and Chagadia. Oh, yeah, well, ours offers Gebrachs, non Gebrachs, kidneyous, non kidneyous, Chol Bistro, Chol Stam, and a Chomets option. Woo! A singing chef, a deep fried mother in law, grilling all Yom Tif and Shabbos. We actually make the Korach sandwich, three Mizbeachs on site. A non kidneyous sushi chef. Or how about this one? We have a shochet doing live on site. And guess what? It's on the children's schedule. <laughs> 24 hour tea rooms. You can't forget about the tea rooms. So I was thinking about, because now that I'm thinking about, you know, it's going to be a big business next year because everybody's going to be wanting to go to these Pesach programs. I mean, we're all like so cooped up in our house. So I was thinking of two programs that I was going to, uh, to advertise. What do you think of this? Pesach in Siberia. Guests <laughs> are in your room. Traditional borscht. Traditional yapchik. Traditional potatoes come to the place where potatoes started. Entertainment, real live blood libel. Oh. Uh. How about we have a game <laughs> for kids? It's called Find Your Passport. <laughs> and then I had my other one. And what? Uh, tell me what you think of this one. Passover in Syria. Ooh. Real adventure tour experience the exodus from Egypt by trying to flee the country. Entertainment, Yeshiva <laughs> Boys Choir, only 10 will make it home. Visit Saddam Hussein's palace, but there's nothing left for you to take. Visit the graves of Mordechai and Esther, not from the Purim story. I'm talking about the two Zman correspondents who were caught last year after, after they exposed all the ISIS leaders. <laughs> Watch a real live reenactment of Yehudas and Holly Furness performed by the ISIS boys choir. It's glad kosher. 
and halal slaughtering on site. <laughs> we'll have so many female speakers like Revis and Twersky or someone else. We're not sure since we haven't seen under the burqa. <laughs> yeah. Especially designed rope courses for Zionists. And here at <laughs> the bottom of the advertisement, it's going to say, it's going to be the bomb. <laughs> Woo! Be a blast. Airfare sponsored by Natura Carta. <laughs> <laughs>